Uh, achievement time. This is Man Eater by Nelly Furtado, an enthralling game of revenge. In this game, we take control of a bull shark seeking vengeance towards the people who have disregarded marine habitats and dishonored her family. With amazing gameplay and subtle notes of cultural and political commentary on the destruction of natural habitats, this became one of my favorite games of the year. It's a fun and relaxing journey of destruction. I've documented my journey through the game, collecting all 32 achievements and 100% completing the game. So please sit back and relax, and join me through an amazing experience of Maneater. The trophies and achievements are fairly easy to collect. The entire game can be completed in 9 or 10 hours. The achievements are for collecting all the license plates and nutrient caches, discovering all landmarks, defeating all the apex predators, reaching infamy level 10, and completing all the objectives with a few other miscellaneous achievements. We start the game off as a Momo Bull Shark. We must first finish the tutorial, then we are rewarded with a lifeguard certificate. After encountering our villain, Scaly Pete, and falling victim to his medieval conservation techniques, we unlock our inheritance. A life of pain and an achievement, Survivor. The achievements come hard and fast from here on out. Upon finishing our breakfast, we escape to our grotto, where we'll evolve for the first time. Another achievement unlocks. Now for the real meat of the game. It's basically one big checklist. We're going to have to finish all the encounters, open up the nutrient caches, discover all the landmarks, and bite all the license plates. I do some of them and return to the grotto for another evolution growing up. The apex of the bayou becomes available after completing some goals for the area. I make short work of it. The time has come to call on the people for our next achievement. I gobble up some people and have the hunters call to me. I snack on Bayou Willie, return to the grotto, and evolve again. Now that I can legally drink, I tidy up some more objectives and go after the Apex Mako Shark. Nothing can quench my thirst for food. Time for a nap and my achievement. I backtrack and clean up all the tasks for the Bayou region. This gets me the Gator Meat and Dominating the Bayou achievements. I take down two more Apex Predators and marvel in my accomplishments. The water is now less polluted. Time to catch up with Scaly Pete. Doing so catches us the survive again and new breed achievements. Our run-in with Pete has made us stronger. Back at the grotto, we evolve once more to Elder. Now that we've aged gracefully, we can clean up shop. I double back and finish all objectives in Dead Horse Lake, Golden Shores, Sapphire Bay, and Prosperity Sands. Nice! I tackle the apex great white shark along the way. Caviar Key is next. With no real challengers left, I return to home and grow up to the mega shark. Nothing will stop us now. The final landmark is found. Bravo to the developers and narrator. These are some of my favorite parts of the game. I'll touch on that some more later, but for now we have the final apex predator to fight, the sperm whale, netting us two more achievements. Scaly Pete has some beef with us, so we head over to sort it out. Now that we're the captain, we just have to pick up the last few collectibles. Nutrient caches, done, license plates, Done. That is all the collecting done now. Now I must simply reach Infamy level 10 and collect my final evolution and my final achievement. Man Eater is brilliant. One of the most fun and engaging games of the year. A simple premise wonderfully executed. The achievements were hardly grindy 
and nothing ever felt like a chore. It was a blast play. That's been all for me. I hope you'll play this game if you haven't. If you've enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. Share the video so other achievement geeks can see this awesome game. Next week, I'll post another gamer score guide like this for either Lego Indiana Jones or Batman Arkham Asylum. Comment down below which game you'd like to see me tackle. Have a great day, and stay safe.